All right, guys. Trying again. So, what we have here is a failure to communicate because despite all my admonitions to pour slowly and carefully, to use gentle pressure, things like that, what I ended up with is a mixture that is just very slightly off. I've got like something like 93 milliliters of hardener in here and only, sorry, and 102 milliliters of actual resin because, you know, that was the last of my jugs. So I had to, uh, got a little too heavy handed with the pouring. So I'm going to use this mixture, not as intended, but, uh, I'm really hoping that the mixture is still close enough that I can uh, still make some useful goods out of it. So, get it all mixed up nice and thoroughly. Tell you what, got my cool little skull mold here. <clears throat> Very gently add a flower. You know, I've been wanting to see for a while now what happens when you add organic material to uh, to resin. And uh, I guess we're about to find out. Okay, so flower is in there upside down because that's the top of the skull. Got my nine to ten mixture. Not quite enough to fill up the skull. So I will leave that to cure overnight. 
we will check its progress tomorrow. <clears throat> Try to figure out whether or not we just got to throw the whole thing out, start over, or if it was close enough for government work. Come on, you little buggers. Get out of there. All right. I'd like to officially thank Jan Shuin, once again, hoping I'm pronouncing that right, for providing me with my first bottles of resin to work with. And um, we will see how this mixture turns out. So that's it for now, guys. Thank you for joining me. Like, share, subscribe.